Buzz and welcome back to Subscriber Request Month, the month where I take requests from you, my subscribers. That was self-explanatory, I didn't need to say that. So uh, basically what I'm doing this month is I'm taking all the... So basically what I'm doing this month is I am taking all of the requests that I have gotten from you guys in the comments and in Instagram messages and basically anywhere else that you've ever requested that I do anything and I am filming them all and uploading them to my channel this month. So if you have any requests that you want me to do, uh, make sure to leave those in the comments down below because I have a pretty packed schedule but you know I could always squeeze in another video or two. Um, so if you have a specific video you want me to make, let me know. Today's request comes to us from subscribers subscriber Twinkie Toes and he or she, I can't tell from the username, requested that I try out one of the ThreadUp reject boxes. So I have mixed feelings about these reject boxes because ThreadUp used to donate all of the items that they didn't end up purchasing from you and now they're selling them, which on one hand it's like, well I'd rather them be donated, but on the other hand it's a really good value because for example I got the mixed clothing box and this baby was $38 for 10 items of clothing um, and I'm really nervous to open it because all you do is you give them your size and then they send you 10 mystery items so you have no control over it. So today I'm going to unbox this on camera and try the pieces on for you guys and hopefully we get some good ones, um, but if not it'll be really funny and this will be a very laughable video. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Okay, I am greeted with many colors and textures upon opening this. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Um, automatically, obviously, really drawn to this. Hopefully, it's cute. Okay, so I'm just gonna start. Oh my goodness. All right, well, this is from the brand Lily White. It is a medium because that is the size that I ordered. This is getting donated. <laughs> Not off to a great start. All right, this is friggin' awful. This is like, Elle Woods fashion gone wrong. But you can't use half the t-shirt on China Silk. It'll pucker. And you didn't just get this in because I saw him last name's Vogue. And the Oscar goes to... <laughs> okay, this looks like it's something tie-dye. Oh, it's workout leggings. Okay, I can deal with these. These aren't awful. I'm not normally like a tie-dye fan, but they feel like they'd be comfy and like, you really need to look that great when you work out. These are from Yogo Athletica. Again, a medium and they're just, they look like they're maybe crop, but I'm a short person, so they might be full length on me. They're definitely high-waisted. Or are they? Who knows? I will try them on for you and we will see. Okay, so here are the workout leggings. They are indeed high-waisted and they're like capri, like three-quarter length. Um, they're comfy. I don't know if they go with like my existing workout gear, but yeah, I'll wear them. I'll wear them to the gym. Okay, this is the item of clothing that I was excited about. Oh, this is cute. Okay, so this is like a little mustard off the shoulder top and it has three quarter length bell sleeves and like this little like ruffly peplum thing and it looks like it's like almost a teeny bit high low. This is good, I would buy this, I would wear this. I wonder if this is like, all this stuff is from like one person who donated stuff. But this is really cute, I'm gonna wear this. Okay, that's a win. Definitely a win. Um, oh, this is a dress. It's a like denim -y dress. It's got a elastic waistline and this like peasant tie up thing here. It's by Massimo. You know, this really isn't my style. It's not a terrible piece. It's in like good condition. I don't think I'll wear it, so I will probably donate it. But if this was your style, I mean, all right, so here's this dress. Not my favorite, but like somebody could rock it. Maybe if you like rolled up the sleeves, it looks like there's a button. So I bet there's a ha ha there is. You can do it like that. So if you were to like do up the arms, it'd be kind of like that. Not terrible. Okay, next we have, oh, hello. So this is a striped top. It's got like cap sleeves and a boat neck and like some piping on it. And it's like a really structured woven material and it's got like a zipper. I think it's supposed to be like a dress shirt. This is gonna look awful on me. Got a pair of J. Crew dress pants in a size eight, which that's gonna be too big for me. I'm like a four or a six. That's like a medium, right? They're like navy blue and they're just boot cut, it looks like. These are of no use to me because I don't work in an office. Oh yeah, for those of you who don't know, um, I am a stay-at-home like graphic designer, video editor, creative for hire. Um, so if you guys need any creative work done, um, I'll put the link to my website and my portfolio down in the description. But yeah, I'm doing that full-time now. Yay! So I will not be wearing these, but I don't know. If you were in an office, they'd be useful. I'll show you. You can definitely see like wear on the zipper. It's like all beat up. 
But other than that, the quality looks good. Okay, so you probably recognize the top from earlier, but here are the J. Crew slacks. These are so awkward. I'm 5'2", are these supposed to be capris? Cause they're like too short to be pants. But the way that the this would be super awkward is capris. Like if you were a normal sized person, like just like kind of chilling there. I will say they are very, very comfortable though. They're like really stretchy. Like I could run in these. Eh, I'm starting to get a little nervous. We've only found one one thing we like in here so far. Well, the light. Two. Two that I probably wear. Another denim. Oh, this is cute too. Okay, so this is another off-the-shoulder top, kind of like the yellow one. They're very similar, um, except for this one has long sleeves, and it looks like it has like a tie detail down here, and it's this like light like chambray material. And it is by Divided, which I believe is an H&M brand. This could be cute for fall. I never know what to wear like long sleeve tops that are like a denim color with though because like can't wear jeans or you look like Britney Spears and Justin Timberlake at that one award show. Anybody know what I'm talking about? I'll put a picture here. But this is cute. I'll wear this. I'll, I'll figure out a way to wear it. <laughs> okay gut reaction to this one is it's cute. The cut's a little awkward like I don't really know what this is. It's like a little bit tight around here but it's cute you could definitely work with it. So I don't know if you can see this, but like this is like a big pocket. Like you could smuggle stuff in this, but it like creates this weird like pouch thing. I don't know, I think I'd still wear it. Oh my gosh. Okay, here's the shirt that I just received in this box. It's by Massimo, it's a dusty rose color. It's got a pocket, short sleeve, it's a medium. And this is a shirt that's currently in my closet. It's literally the exact same shirt. Like, they sent me a shirt that I already own. Pocket, Massimo, same cut. I got mine super oversized because I wear it as like a night shirt, but literally this is the exact same thing. What are the odds that I would get something that I already own? <laughs> I mean, this is like actually my size. The one I got is like a large because it's the only size they had in the store and it was on clearance for like $3. Um, so maybe I'll like find a way to like actually wear this. like during the daytime. I like the color, clearly I liked it because I bought it myself. Too funny. So here's the t-shirt that I already own. Um, I like the color, it's got a little pocket. I'm a fan of this, I mean when I bought it at Target it was like literally $3, so I don't know how much the value's there, but like I'll wear this. Twinsies! Okay, we've got two more pieces in here. It's from Old Navy. It's like bright orange, like as techy looking print. It's a t-shirt, medium. Hello, I'm the orange highlighter. Nice to meet you. Guys, this last piece is the coup de gras of this entire box. Behold, a pink one piece swimsuit with a friggin' skirt. It's got like little boob cups and it's a halter neck, it's all ruched. This is hilarious. You know what this looks like? It looks like a costume that would be worn by like a synchronized swimming team in like the 50s. ten of our items so all in all we got like four that are wearable so five if you count that denim dress I don't personally like it but it's not it's not a terrible dress like somebody might might really like it so the mauve shirt uh, the two off the shoulder tops which were definitely my favorite items I really liked those and then the leggings so all in all for $38 not the best deal in the world because I ended up paying like ten dollars for like each of the pieces that i actually liked and the rest i will definitely donate but i don't know it was fun to unbox it i don't think i would do it again but it was fun to do it once and if you get really lucky you could get some really really good pieces in this but it's definitely a mixed bag because you have no control at all thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you did and subscribe to my channel because i would love to have you here as a bud um and send me any other requests that you have um because the whole month of August is subscriber request month. I have some really fun requests coming up that I'm so glad that you guys requested because I never would have thought of like filming those videos on my own. Specifically, there's a challenge video that I'm doing with Matt that I am so stoked about. It's gonna be hilarious. But until then, I hope you guys are having an awesome day wherever you are and I'll see you all with my next video. Bye!